I love doing drawings. Good morning everyone and welcome back to my channel. This morning I just woke up and did some boring stuff like pay bills and prep for meetings and things like that. So now I'm gonna do a little bit of self-care before my first meeting today. Also, excuse my voice and my sniffly nose. We slept with the window open last night and my allergies are not happy. Okay, I just washed my face and now I'm gonna put a face mask on. So this is my favorite one by far. I got it in an Ipsy box a long time ago. Innis Free Pore Cleansing Clay Mask. I believe it is a Korean product. Um, I'm almost out of this one actually, so I asked for some more for Christmas, but I just love how like smooth it makes my skin feel. I just wait 10 to 15 minutes or until it gets hard. My face is hard now. I'm gonna go wash it off. Okay, I just washed the mask off my face and now I'm going to apply a pore strip. So I just used the Biore brand. I brought a wet paper towel to wet my nose so I could do it in here. So you just wet your nose, peel the strip off of like the clear backing and then apply the sticky side to your face. All right, and then I let it sit until it gets hard. Otherwise, I think the package says 10 minutes. So it doesn't take a lot of time. I'll check back in with you guys when I don't look like this. All right, let's see how gross this thing is. Not too bad today. I've been staying really consistent with like doing a face mask every week and doing a nose pore strip every week so hopefully those are helping. <laughs> so I'm just gonna go in with some Cetaphil daily moisturizer because my face is feeling crusty. So I wanted to get Starbucks again this morning because the drink yesterday was just so good I'm craving it again but I have a meeting in about 20 minutes and I need to be caffeinated for that. And I'm definitely not going to make it to Starbucks before then. So I guess I am going to settle for some coffee here at home. And maybe I'll take a trip there later today. you guys my meeting just ended it's 1 p.m i haven't eaten anything today i am starving so let's go eat some eggs with onion and mushroom and some turkey bacon yum all right, here I am making my second trip to Starbucks in the past two days. I've just really been craving that holiday drink that I got yesterday. So I'm going to go get it again. By the way, I just filmed a makeup routine for you guys. So that's why I look human again. Wow, the workers in there today were so nice. It was also like so warm in there. I was sweating. I got myself a venti today. So excited. Catch me sitting in the parking lot while the people next to me stare at me. 
just as good as I remember. Wow. So I figured out the HelloFresh problem. I got on the phone with someone today and they're gonna give us a refund, which is fine. Just wish I would have had that food, but that's okay. At least we got a refund. They were super nice about it. It's so misty and gross outside today and it's getting dark. It's literally 2.30 and it's getting dark out. I guess I'll just go lay in bed and be sad. Just kidding. I have a lot to do today still. Let's get going. Here's my drink order in case you didn't see it yesterday. I got a venti iced peppermint white mocha with no whip, some caramel drizzle, and vanilla sweet cream cold foam. Look at this cute boy. Are you comfy? Look. What are you looking at? Look at me. You're cute. Yeah, you. You're cute. Yeah. Kisses? <laughs> so I have spent the last couple hours doing some homework and I'm getting ready to do something exciting tonight. So tonight my church group is doing a virtual game night and although I wish it wasn't virtual, they are getting us free Jimmy John's. So in a little bit, I'm gonna go pick that up and then we're gonna have a fun virtual game night. I also wanted to show you guys, I have these like icicle string lights along my whole ceiling, but the second set of lights is basically like completely out. There's just this one little section here, but the lights are connected in the wall of this set of lights. So I can't just remove this set and keep the working set. I would have to move everything. So I'm really upset that these are out, but we used to put these on my parents' house for like 10 years. So sitting out in the cold Wisconsin winters, it makes sense that they don't really work. But I think that this winter I am gonna get another set because it just like, it's so dark in here now and I have to put that light on, which is, so bright and it makes it so hot in here so i definitely need to get more lights sorry for my squeaky floor so i just turned the lights off in here that light over there so you can see but it's just so dark over here and i have these like lining my closet <laughs> that was casper playing with the blinds but it's just so sad and i need to make it look cozier in here so i definitely need to get more lights so sorry I keep talking about the lights, but what's wrong? <laughs> so, so, what? <sighs> Needy boy. Oh, okay. You don't like the bed anymore? <laughs> it's just so sad in here without these lights. Like, so pretty. So sad. I gotta get that fixed. Did he leave you? Oh no, where did he go? Where did he go? <laughs> Do you see him? Go get him. Go. Go get him. It may be dark, cold, and rainy, but I'm getting my Jimmy John's. I got the goods. All right, I don't think I've ever gotten one of these lunch packs from there before. I normally just get a sandwich, so let's see what's in here. Ooh, salt and vinegar chips, my favorite. They burn my mouth, but taste so good. Do you know what I mean? 
a sub. I got the tuna. I love the tuna from there. At some sub restaurants, I don't like the tuna, but here it's so good. They do put too much lettuce on their subs though. I got a pickle in a Ziploc bag. An oatmeal raisin cookie. A packet of mayo. A packet of mustard. And some freaky pass napkins. I'm so excited. First bite. Mm. I love Jimmy John's. One critique I do have. I don't like cucumber on my sandwiches. I'm so happy you guys. I cannot remember the last time I had Jimmy John's. Thank you, church. Salt and vinegar chips. I'm ready for my mouth to burn. So good. Mm -mm -mm. Literally the best salt and vinegar chips ever. I've ever tried the best so a funny story about Jimmy John's my dad and I went there for the first time we had gotten it before but it was like group orders of things similar to this we had never gone to the store ourselves so we ordered our subs and the subs were ready before we even paid for them and we were like wow I understand why their slow goes freaky fast this is amazing and that is one of the reasons I love Jimmy John's. Game night starting in like five minutes, so I'm just gonna hang out and eat with you guys. <laughs> so this sandwich made me think of something. Fun fact about me, I did not like tomatoes until like two years ago. I hated them as a kid. If they were in a sandwich or a wrap or anything, it ruined the whole thing for me. And then I was maybe a freshman or sophomore in college and I ate one and I liked it and I don't know when I started liking them but now I'm obsessed with them like I will have a tomato sandwich like I'll put like a little bit of mozzarella and some pesto but like I can eat tomatoes plain now and I always hated them so if you hated something when you were a kid and you haven't tried it in a long time try it because you might like it so crazy I'm literally just sitting here for 10 minutes eating and talking to myself. I'm gonna have to edit so much of this out. My computer's sitting here waiting for the game night zoom to start and it just restarted. It's at 3%. Why is this happening? Another cucumber. Game night starting. See you later. Group me always makes me feel so special. Thanks, group me. So game night just ended. It was so fun to catch up with people. We played some Jackbox and some Kahoot and then we played Among Us for a really long time. So that was super fun. And I'm gonna go see what Dominic's doing but I think we're gonna watch a Christmas movie or something and just relax. Otherwise, after that, I'm just gonna go to bed. So I'm gonna end the video here. I hope that you guys enjoyed. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know what content you would like to see and I will see you in the next one. Bye!